Hi, so this is question two of the GCSE practice papers on working with 3D Pythagoras. It's the one I've actually used for the histograms cheat sheet, so this is the actual answer for this question. Uh, as I mentioned on the, uh, on the sheet before, uh, what we're trying to do is we're trying to work out PQ, which is this length along here. So if we look at that particular triangle, what we've got is something like this where we know this is p and q and that's what they want us to answer the question on um, also we do know that this is a height of 12 but we don't know this well in order to use pythagoras to solve this particular question we have to work out this so what i'm going to do is i'm going to call that a and so we've got a q along there well hopefully you can see that we have a further right angle triangle which is on the bottom of this cube and it looks like that so if i just kind of draw that out we've got this type of triangle where this dimension is three this dimension is four so this is three along here and this is four along here and a q which we need to work out is going to be the same measurement that we're going to use for our big triangle in order to answer the question. Okay, so uh, using Pythagoras, we've got AQ squared equals 3 squared plus 4 squared, and that's going to be 3 squared is 9 plus 4 squared is 16, so it means that AQ squared equals 25, or AQ equals 5 because then the square root of 25 is 5. Okay so we can use that information now we know this is 5 we can pop that into here so this dimension along here is 5 uh, centimeters so if we pop that dimension in we've got then PQ which is what we're looking to find out equals 5 squared which is this one here plus 12 squared which is this one along here so 5 squared plus 12 squared is going to give you 169. So therefore PQ equals the root of 169, which equals 13 centimetres. So in this particular question, PQ equals 13 centimetres. I um, hope that's okay for you. Please do uh, have a look at the GCSE practice questions. You can download those from the link below in the description. I look forward to seeing you inside the next video.